I invite you now to rise in body or in spirit as we sing our closing hymn, which is in your order of service. We're going to be singing Now is the Time. You can find the music on this insert. Can this go on? Oh, it is on. Okay. This hymn was actually composed in 2007, but it is still new to most of us, so we're going to learn it together. I'm going to sing a phrase to you, and please sing it back to me. Now is the time for hearts to be open. Now is the time for hearts to be open. No better time, this moment of grace. This is the day we can't wait for tomorrow or someday. This is the day we can't wait for tomorrow or someday. Now is the time. Now is the time. May the legacies of our ancestors teach us, warn us, and bless us. May the legacies we create today equip and nourish our descendants whom we will never know, but whose lives are already intertwined with ours. May our life stories continue to nurture a few worthy things as we shape our legacy together. Amen. And now won't you say with me our extinguishing the chalice words found in your order of service. We extinguish this flame, but not the light of truth, the warmth of community, or the fire of commitment. These we carry in our hearts until we are together again.
We have a few final announcements for this week. Um, if you are looking for another way to participate in Family Promise, drivers are needed to drive families from the host church to the day center in Egg Harbor City in the morning, then back to the host church in the afternoon. Additional drivers are needed to fill in when regular drivers need to take a break. Shelly McElvain, our driver coordinator, will arrange a schedule that works for you. Any help is appreciated from several times a week to once a month. Contact Barbara Miller or, Sherry, or Shelly McElvain if you have questions to sign up. I am also aware that our week is coming up when? March 11th. March 11th. And because Deb is having shoulder surgery, we're gonna need a little extra help in the cat herding department. Um, so please see Deb to help out with that. Super Bowl Sunday soup sale yielded $658 in profit for Family Promise. For those who are new or visiting, Family Promise is a local um, housing justice um, project and we provide housing to families um, that are without houses at the moment and we work with other congregations and, and churches in the area to do that. Um, assignments have been made and distributed for the February 24th Circle Dinners, so now it is time to sign up for the March 24th dinner. For those who are new to this congregation, this is a really cool thing. These are shared meals of up to eight people for the purpose of enjoying each other's company at a relaxing meal. All are invited to participate. You don't have to be a member. This is a totally great way to meet new people. Please visit the table in the back of the sanctuary after worship to learn more. We warmly welcome all of you who are visiting us today. We invite you to stay and have coffee with us so that we can get to know each other better. Parents can now go downstairs to sign their children out of classes. In a couple, wow, Betsy, okay. You have to go get them, Betsy. <laughs> it's a rule. <laughs> you can't just stay up here. <laughs> now let's share a moment of silent reflection to consider today's sermon and the meaning of legacy in our lives. Just a, just a quick reminder, folks, we will have, Laura will be presenting a workshop.